Hey, I'm standing here in front of my yacht. Yeah, right. Um, anyway, I mentioned uh, lens compression in a video a couple days ago. And, uh, you know, it's okay not to know stuff. It's a different thing when you, like, stick to stupidity. It's like, you know, I believe in this, and even though the facts are... Compression. Lens compression is real. Now, here's the difference between math and photography. Math is not photography. I almost said fucking. Uh, <laughs> math is not photography. Now, <clears throat> it is true that you could take a fisheye shot and crop the piss out of it. Of course, it would be grainy as hell and utterly worthless. And make it look like the uh, same shot taken with, say, like the 90 millimeter Fuji here, for example. Right? Well, you see, photographers don't work that way. <laughs> this is the issue that people that uh, believe that there's no such thing as lens compression. Well, yes, there is such thing as lens compression. You see, photographers don't care about the math because here's the secret to lens compression. It does exist because photographers frame the subject the same way. So if you want to frame, say, somebody's face in a shot like this at 35 millimeter, and then slap on, say, a 90 millimeter and frame the face the same way, then, yes, lens compression does exist. And that's exactly how photographers work. Okay? You want to take a face shot at 35 millimeters, 20 millimeters, 100 millimeters, whatever the hell. Okay? Lens compression then does exist. Now, if you're going to stand back at the same distance and slap on a fish eye at 35 millimeter, you know, Photographers don't work that way. People say, well, you know, you, you know, you, you can zoom them up the same and lens compression. It's all geometry. It's like, well, yeah, that is true, but that's not how photographers do their work. They frame the subject the same. Yeah, they don't crop the hell out of the shot. They zoom with their feet, you know, to frame the shot the same. Like, this is why if you want to get like a huge moon behind someone, she's like, my God, why is that moon so huge behind that person's shoulders? Like, well, that person used a 300 millimeter F2.8 backed the hell up and took the shot a portrait shot with a 300 millimeter f2.8 uh-huh they framed the subject the same as they would with an 85 millimeter for example so yes lens compression does exist it does okay bye